Hi, it's Stella from Mipul University, and this is Stella's short and sweet preview for Cartographer's Heroes from Thunderworks Games. The expedition has continued to the western lands for us cartographers, with more dangerous monsters, but with heroes that may come to our aid. The game plays one, two, well, however many players really, with mechanics such as flip and write and line drawing. The game is of light to medium complexity. In this video, I am going to assume that you are familiar with Cartographers, the original game. If not, click here for overview of Cartographers. So I'm going to show you the main things, what Cartographers Heroes brings to the well-loved world of Cartographers. The main mechanics, objectives, explorations are still similar. Cartographers Heroes is a standalone game or can be combined with Cartographers. Cartographers Heroes brings some new scoring cards and it brings new monster cards. Now they have additional effects to the game. Ooh, scary. The new Explore deck can be used instead of the one from the base game to give more varieties. It also introduces new map layout for Cartographers games. What I'm going to highlight now is the Hero Cards, Map Packs expansion, and Skills Mini expansion too. Hero Cards get shoveled to the Explore deck like Monster Cards do. But Hero Cards help destroy monsters around them, depending on the cards revealed. Map Packs expansion adds small rules to the game, like this Nebulous Plane of Flame here. The map has Volcano that erupted when Volcano card is revealed from the Explore deck, filling up spaces and destroying terrain around it. And Skills Mini Expansion 2 brings even more variety. You can spend your hard-earned coins to activate one rule-breaking ability once per season. Cartographers is one of our top 10 games of 2019, so naturally we are excited to see Cartographers Heroes coming out. Cartographers Heroes keeps the main mechanics of the already elegant game and at the same time adding some fresh objectives, small mechanics, maps, which I think works well. My favourite is probably the Heroes cards. Super helpful with getting rid of those pesky monsters that ruin my plan for my beautiful village. And the skills mini expansion too can be powerful at the right time. Like Manipulate that lets you break the chosen shape into two. Or Subvert that lets you draw one square of any terrain type instead during draw phase. The monster cards are pretty cool too, like this Dragon Inferno. If you manage to surround or destroy the spaces, gains three coins. Or Zombie Plague that forces player to draw a zombie in adjacent empty space, so it's thematic too. The volcano in Nebulous map that keeps destroying land around it is a good mechanic to add. You can destroy monsters this way in your terrain that is not going to score again. Man, they can go. So if you play a lot of the game like us, you'll probably welcome the new additions for even more variety of cartographer's games. So thanks for watching, folks. At the time of filming, Cartographer's Heroes is about to be launched on Kickstarter. So I'll put the link in the description when it is live. The components featured in this video are prototype, so rules and artwork are not final. If you have any questions for me, please write in the comment sections below. You would help us by subscribing to Meeple University and hit the bell so you won't miss anything from us. I also share my board games journey on Instagram, so hopefully I'll see you there too. Until next time! What? Now what? Where? Ah, <laughs> oops, silly me. Just having fun with coloring pencils. You know, making village. It's well worth it.